I have spent the last few days trying this uh, Vichy Vite 10% Vitamin C uh, Serum. Let's see what my findings are. Okay, so first of all, when you buy it, it costs $27 and um, I order it online on the Vichy website and they also send me some uh, samples of the same product. <laughs> So what you buy is this package right here that uh, contains 10 of these uh, ampoules. You know what, it took me like 10 minutes just to look for the right pronunciation of the word ampoules and then actually practice uh, saying that. So please appreciate my effort and uh, I like this video. I am very grateful. So like I said, in the package you find uh, 10 of these uh, ampoules, um, just like this, okay? And uh, um, Vichy says that uh, um, each ampoule keep the product fresh for uh, 48 hours. Um, in my experience, it actually lasted uh, longer, meaning that um, assuming that you cover with the cap that they provide you, um, I was able to use it for three days um, in a row which means that the whole package lasted me uh, a month instead of 20 days which is a uh, uh, very good thing considering again that I paid $27 for the whole uh, package. I used this serum in my morning routine along with a few drops of the hyaluronic acid. Um, this serum Vichy's vitamin C serum um, does contain some hyaluronic acid as well and this is why um, it feels super duper hydrating however um, I like uh, you know I like to add a little bit more just because um, I do not drink a lot of water throughout the day because if you know me you know I'm never thirsty for some reason so it's very difficult for me to drink water and this is why I wanted to use a little bit more um, hyaluronic acid having skin that's very dehydrated and dry like look at my my lips for example but if you don't have this problem you can uh, definitely use it alone it is um, super hydrating this serum by itself already okay don't get me wrong um, it is not sticky I didn't experience uh, any tingling or burning sensation since uh, the first application which is very good because I usually have a, a sensitive skin that becomes red even uh, just by taking a, sh a shower with water that's uh, too hot okay so um, I didn't experience any of that so I guess it's suitable for sensitive skin at least for my sensitive um, skin and the reason why this serum feels so hydrating if we look at the actual ingredients list is that uh, it contains water and then vitamin C that we know it's 10% and then it contains butylene glycol and hyaluronic acid which are both humectant uh, ingredients which means they draw moisture to uh, your skin. So if you have normal skin, um, you don't need to apply, you probably won't need to apply a moisturizer after this uh, serum, making your skincare routine very, very simple. Um, conversely, if you have dry skin, you still want to apply a sunscreen or a moisturizer um, after this, uh, this vitamin C serum. The fact that it comes in this uh, double dose or triple dose ampoules is, uh, is super cool because uh, it, it really gives me the, um, I really feel like the vitamin C it has been well uh, preserved and has not been uh, oxidized. We have seen that um, is vitamin C, it's like you say tap 
and it's already oxidized so it's very important that it is properly uh, packed and packaged and this uh, serum um, gives me this uh, um, this peace of mind or oh, peace of me <laughs> whatever peace of mind okay that uh, the vitamin C is there and it's gonna work after uh, I would say between the first after the first seven to ten days I started to notice um, that my skin um, okay it was just a little bit more uh, glowing I don't have uh, hyperpigmentation so I didn't use this serum as um, for hyperpigmentation but I did notice uh, my skin that was more radiant and glowing it also could be because I was using it together with the hyaluronic acid serum uh, I'm not sure but uh, um, I'm gonna continue using it without the hyaluronic acid uh, serum and see what happens. However, I did, uh, like I said, you know I never lie, I did felt uh, and saw that my skin was um, more radiant. Um, in general, it had more light, okay? I don't know if it, I don't think it was a placebo effect because I'm very careful on this um, so I really think that uh, it was working uh, very well one thing is that you don't have to apply too much a few drops is enough sometimes I made the mistake of applying it too much and at that point my skin was not glowing was just greasy and too shiny like I have um, oily skin which I don't so be careful just to use the right amount and don't overdo it because it is not uh, necessary the only thing that I didn't like about this serum is the claim that uh, contains um, the claim that they make on the packaging that uh, saying that this serum contains phytopeptides okay it's true that it contains phytopeptides however in the consumer perception it's like it contains like peptides synthetic peptides okay but this is not the case okay it, it does not contain um, you know specific uh, proteins synthetic proteins it only contains some natural extracts that might contain some uh, proteins but uh, first of all their amount is so low they're so diluted they are not gonna do anything and uh, uh, second of all remember that peptides are not like retinol okay there is no uh, solid scientific evidence that they work uh, for anti-aging so Vichy it's like um, it's you know implying that this product might work very well for anti-aging because besides the vitamin C has also the peptides but again this is not the case and I don't want you to think that because it's just not true so overall this is a great vitamin C serum if you want to uh, start to incorporate vitamin C in your daily routine and are uh, on a budget conversely if you feel like uh, spending a little bit more uh, for yourself maybe you know Valentine's Day is approaching you are single and you just want to make yourself a gift you can check it out my vitamin C serum that besides vitamin C also contain um, contain niacinamide in my experience uh, coupling these two uh, ingredients really max out the benefits of both so Again, this is it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you like it, share it with a friend and I'll see you in the next one.